Ulva Ulstotter Eriksson. I'm a professor of sociology at the University of Gothenburg and Linnaeus University in Sweden. Sweden is considered one of the most gender equal countries in the world and scores high on gender equality index. Gender equality has been institutionalized in the Swedish policy since the 1970s when the first gender political goal was taken by the parliament. The foundation for gender equality is on women's and men's equal right to shape society and their own lives. In the labor market context, key issues are equality in power and influence, equal opportunities in work, equal pay and general conditions. Gender e equality is prim primarily addressed in policy, laws and regulations. In that way, gender equality is not that aligned with the Swedish model, which rely heavily on self-regulating autonomous social partners. Trade unions and employer organizations are still engaged and address gender equality in reports, on web pages, in debates, campaigns, etc. Those engaged in gender equality perceive that much is in place, but more can be done. And some think that collective bargaining and collective agreements could be used more forcefully. Sweden has a, a well-developed infrastructure for gender equality through several policy goals, laws and regulations and several authorities that promote and monitor compliance with the regulations. The most relevant laws for promoting gender equality are coercive and not negotiable and extends to everyone. The Discrimination Act forbids any discrimination with regards to sex, gender, transgender identity, ethnicity, religion and other beliefs, disability, sexual orientation and age. Social partners on peak and sectoral level engage in gender equality in different ways. In dialogues and collaborations with uh, political parties, civil society organizations and authorities. They produce reports and statistics on gender equality in their sectors and produce handbooks and guides on how to work with gender equality at the local level. The Swedish labor market is strongly gender segregated. Women and men work in different occupations. The majority of employees work in occupations dominated by one sex. The interviewed workers were highly informed on gender equality problems and identified gaps in wages, parental leave, career opportunities and occupational gender segregation. They perceived gender equality as a top-down issue, meaning that managers and leaders must lead by examples. They also thought that trade unions and local level could be more active in promoting gender equality issues. The regulative framework in Sweden is well developed and comprehensive. Still, commitment is required locally by everyone, employers, trade unions and employees, to avoid that gender equality becomes only a women's issue. Engage all in gender equality work. It is not a women's issue. Counteract gender stereotypes as they hinder gender equality and equal opportunity include and expand intersectional perspectives on gender equality. <laughs>